What's in food and why it matters? Almost every type of food will affect your blood sugar levels. In order to make healthy food choices, it's important to understand how. Let's first see how food affects blood sugar levels in a healthy person without diabetes. The graph shows the relationship between blood sugar level and time in hours after eating. The blood sugar level is in both international scales. Before eating or drinking, a healthy person's blood sugar will be below 100. When they eat a typical meal, their blood sugar will rise and then after a few hours, it will begin to fall back below 100. A person with diabetes though, starts with a higher blood sugar level before they eat. When they eat the same meal, their blood sugar rises higher and it takes longer to come back to their baseline. Blood sugar levels that are too high for too long lead to complications. This video will show how various food groups can cause blood sugar to rise differently. There are three main nutrients within food. First are carbohydrates or starch such as grains, tubers, vegetables, and fruits. Second is protein. And third is fat. Foods are often a mix of the three nutrients. Beans have carbohydrates and protein. Eggs have both protein and fat. Milk products like yogurt have protein, fat, and carbohydrates. Carbohydrates have the greatest effect on your blood sugar levels. These foods are broken down into sugar once you eat them. Sweet things turn into sugar, but other foods do too, like rice, maize, yam, potato, and foods made from wheat. Processed foods often contain a lot of added sugars fat, and simple starches without fiber. These foods make your blood sugar rise high even more quickly and stay high for a long time. These junk foods are linked to obesity and diet-related chronic diseases, including type 2 diabetes, dementia, heart disease, and some cancers. Try to avoid processed foods. Instead, eat natural, unprocessed carbohydrates such as vegetables, fruits, whole grains, and beans. These foods have plenty of fiber, which is healthy and slows down the rise in your blood sugar level. Protein has a smaller effect on blood sugar levels and the effect tends to occur gradually over a few hours. Eating protein can also keep you satisfied for longer. You may eat less and lose weight. Choose healthy protein foods, especially those that are plant-based, including beans, nuts and seeds, as well as fish, eggs, poultry, and yogurt. Eat lean meat, but only rarely. We mostly eat fat with other foods. A high fat meal, such as fried chips, can lead to a delayed rise in your blood sugar, five to 10 hours after a meal. Use healthy natural oils in moderation, such as sunflower, olive, or safflower oil. Avoid processed solid fats, such as margarine. What you drink also affects your blood sugar levels. Water is best. Coffee and tea are also fine with little to no sugar. 
Avoid sugary drinks. Soda has an enormous quantity of sugar. It makes your blood sugar rise high quickly, as well as make you gain weight and internal belly fat. Fruit juice contains natural sugar and sometimes added sugar. It also raises your blood sugar. Instead of drinking juice, eat the whole fruit with its natural fiber. Alcohol contributes to weight gain and fatty liver. It can make your blood sugar level drop hours after drinking. It's best to avoid alcohol. Your portion sizes also affect your blood sugar levels. Using a small plate, make your largest portion non-starchy vegetables with a smaller amount of healthy, fiber-rich carbohydrates and protein. What you eat affects your overall health, your blood pressure, your blood sugar level, the level of fats in your blood, and how well your heart, kidneys, and liver function. Remember, to keep your blood sugar levels in a healthy range, eat natural, unprocessed carbohydrates, protein-rich foods, and healthy fats in moderation. Eating healthy will help you stay healthy.